so it's did you see that clip with the, the the female candidate running for office who goes off on the war on women and the audience starts cracking up oh, yeah. like they can't control yeah, themselves yeah. anymore it's gotten so absurd on the left hasn't it oh my it gosh, really has it's unbelievable i mean dan you know five years ago when when you were first listening to me and i said you know things are going to be upside down you won't recognize your country and uh up will be down down will be up what was liquid it'll be solid you never really thought we'd actually get there did you I mean, because I, I only halfway you know, did, and I was one saying it. <laughs> I, I remember reading on my time when I had a personal Facebook feed all of the, you know, the left-wing uh, bloggers who would say, this guy's crazy. But you notice none of them are saying that now because they're afraid mm-hmm. to reprint and link to the old articles where the stuff actually happened. The dark mm-hmm. money you were always talking about between Tides and Soros funding these campaigns. And, you know, they do the little di- dipsy do flip with us to left, you know, dark money, the Koch brothers. Meanwhile, the Koch brothers are like number 15th in the country in donations mm-hmm. behind all these left wing people who are out there pumping money into campaigns. All the stuff you talked about, about undue influence into our government and, and the total evaporation like an Alka-Seltzer tablet of liberty uh, is now sadly coming true. And Americans need to wake up and the independents among us and the moderate democrats need to wake up too that don't think they won't come after you next 